This is the Great Value Disinfectant Spray. Hello everyone and welcome to Gus Random Reviews. Let's take a closer look to this product and see what to expect. Great Value Disinfectant Spray disinfects and sanitizes both hard and soft surfaces. It also eliminates odors directly from its source and when used as directed, it is very effective against bacteria, mold, mildew, germs, and many viruses. That includes COVID-19. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, it kills COVID-19. Here's what to expect with this disinfectant. This can right here is about 19 ounces and it weighs about one pound and three ounces. It is aerosol with a scented scent, um, citrus scent. It kills about 99.9% .9 of germs and viruses within seconds of spraying on its surface and helping prevent mold and mildew growth. You will also eliminate annoying odors and leave behind a clean and pleasant scent. I personally enjoy the morning metal scent because it has a nice spring smell. Now, in regards to helping prevent the growth of mold and mildew, if using it for the purpose, you need to make sure that the treatment is correct, repeated weekly, and not every other week. Otherwise, you will have a problem. You can use this product in the kitchen, in the bathroom, in soft and hard surfaces. There are two different options you can use this for, to disinfect and sanitize. The directions are pretty straightforward. You spray, you let it stand, you wipe it off. You stand, you, you spray, you let it stand, and then you can wash it off. Depends on what you're trying to accomplish. For example, if you wanna sanitize, you will spray, you will leave it for 50 seconds, and then wipe. For disinfecting, you will spray, wait 10 minutes, and then clean by either wiping or rinsing with water. For subsurfaces, you wet the area, but do not saturate the area with a lot of liquid. Then you let it air dry and then repeat the same action often. Let's see this product in action as I demonstrate the correct way to apply the disinfectant spray on several surfaces from my personal opinion. All right, everyone. So the best usage to utilize the disinfectant is to go around your house and target the area that has the most traffic. That includes anything from doorknobs, from bathrooms, from rails, from kitchens, and uh, uh, anything where, you know, hands touch. So what we wanna do first, and I personally uh, use this for, is to quickly sanitize some of the doorknobs around my house. Uh, you have your can, and what you do is you make sure that you shake it very well and within six to eight inches from the target, you press the nozzle with a couple of sprays, okay? So what you wanna do as you can see here is make sure that it's wet, let it stand there for about a minute or so and then come back and wipe it back. Now you wanna have your wipey uh, ready to go whenever you come back and clean this section. So what we'll do is we'll go around the house uh, targeting some of the areas, quickly spraying and then coming back and wiping it off. I'm going to go ahead and target your rails. And more additional doorknobs around your house. Remember, you're making sure that you quickly eliminate any germs that may be residing within areas where it's more likely that you're going to touch. All right, so about a minute or so, you let it stand, you come back, and we will wipe it off. So walking around the house with areas where you kind of target it, you grab a cloth that's dry, 
and you want to make sure that you throughoutly dry it off and then it doesn't contain any more of the disinfectant per se. Same thing, I'm going to go around and just wipe it off. Make sure that it's nice and dry. And this will help sanitize your area by quickly eliminating any germs that may be residing. Continue the process. And this again, it will help eliminate any germs. And this is a quick way to kind of sanitize some of the most common areas where there's a lot of traffic. Now we're gonna move along to an area that requires a little more of disinfecting and that is our bathroom. So come with me. All right, in the bathroom, what you wanna do is, again, you wanna make sure that you shake your can and you spray the area that continues to have the most traffic. Let it sit there for a couple of minutes. Uh, since we are disinfecting instead of sanitizing, Disinfectant requires for uh, the liquid to stay there within 10 minutes. If we're quickly sanitizing, then we're letting it scent for about 50 seconds to a minute and then coming back in and wiping it up but because we want to make sure that we disinfect the bathrooms. Again, just because it has the most uh, traffic out of any place in your house, you want to make sure that you let us sit, sit there a little longer. Now, an area where I feel that requires a lot more of disinfecting is your toilet seat. And that is because obviously when you sit there um, and you have, you know, kids and so forth, it tends to not only, you know, have an area that is going to collect more germs, but also you have odors. Now, the beauty about this can, and I found it, and I found it to be very beneficial is that when you spray this into the area that has a certain smell, it is not only eliminating the smell in the air, but it's also eliminating the odor from its source. So you want to make sure that you target the seat, which obviously may retain some of that odor. So again, you go ahead and spray it until it's throughout the wet. And when you do so, you will come back and wipe it off. Now, in areas that have gaps, you want to go ahead and spray it there. Let it sit there for a little while, and then we're going to come back and wipe it off. All right, it's been 10 minutes. So what you want to do is you come back, and again, what you do is you wipe down the area where you have sprayed the disinfectant. You come back to your seat and you perform the same action by wiping it off until it becomes dry okay now in the area where there is that little gap there you grab yourself a q-tip and you clean it in between the area okay again just because you can't really get your cloth in there washcloth to kind of wipe it down okay so you can see it's bringing down the filth from that specific uh, area and it's gonna make sure that it's sanitized and disinfected at the same time, okay? As mentioned, it kills odors from the target, straight from the source. It's, I mean, it smells much better when you spray this and you clean. Uh, and, and again, it helps you quickly go around the house and sanitize and it also helps you you know disinfect and again this is how I personally use this around the house another area where you can benefit from the disinfectant is your garbage can your garbage can tends to be a, an item that collects not only germs but a lot of odor so what you want to do is and what I do is I remove whatever garbage in here from removing the bag. I will spray it with the disinfectant, uh, let it sit there for 10 minutes, and then instead of wiping it off, we're going to go ahead and wash the, uh, the, the, the garbage can. After you have removed the garbage bag, what you want to do again is grab your can, shake your can, and spray it upright not facing down this way. You want to make sure that you face it upright. 
and you wanna again go through it a couple of sprays spray the areas where you see that there's a potential for germ collection and uh, go ahead and let it sit there for again 10 minutes so we'll go ahead and put it in there when it's roughly wet you can see and then we're gonna go ahead and again let this sit there for about 10 minutes and then we're gonna wash it off so to clean your garbage can actually you're not only just using the disinfectant to remove any potential you know germs and mold and mildew that may be building up but you also want to make sure that you fully clean your garbage can and you just go ahead and you know drop soap in there and grab your water and then make sure that you dump it in there and go ahead and start washing it off now you grab your cloth and go ahead and start washing it off all the way around with soap making sure that it's fully clean don't forget the top portion once you're done with the soap then you rinse it off and you let it air dry and now you have disinfected your garbage can all right guys here's my opinion about this item honestly i really like it this product is as good as any name brand disinfected around and at many times believe it or not it is half the price it is very handy during flu season as it allows very easy and fast sanitizing or disinfecting with the goal of keeping germs at minimal. The can is large enough to last through several uses and also releasing the spray, which is on top here, it does not strain your hand. Nevertheless, Remember that when using this product, you should not substitute your regular, regular deep cleaning. This is more intended for a quick use when you have sick kids, bad odors, and the need to disinfect an area that has been overwhelmed by the growth of mold or mildew or even bacteria and germs. Also, when following the correct steps for using this disinfectant, you will be satisfied with the results. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, to check the link in the comment section for purchase, and give it a thumbs up. Thank you, and I appreciate you.